what's good everyone today we already got the jordan 6 hairs in hand i'm gonna give you guys the first unboxing of them resale predictions stay tuned let's go what's good everyone welcome back to tamster's kicks if you haven't already make sure to smash that subscribe button thanks for all the support today we already got the jordan 6 hairs in hand I'm gonna give a review of them they actually came out on june 17th retailed for $190 and I actually really like these shoes guys these debuted in 1992 on the Jordan 7 model and now almost 30 years later they've been brought back onto these dope Jordan 6s and I think they did a very very good job on them now plug at my local Foot Locker said that there might be some leftover, so I might have to go get some more later. But for now, we walked in Foot Locker, got two pairs with some app reservations at Foot Locker. And immediately when I saw the box, I was drawn to them. Like that is so sick. All the elements that go into the shoe are so dope. Now, before I get into these, make sure to stick around to the end. I'll go very important resale predictions for the Jordan 6 hairs. I know we got a lot of shoes coming out, so I want you guys to know what you should do with your pairs that you got, so stick around. All right, so since it's a Jordan Retro and a men's, it's not a Jordan 1 or anything, the best sizes are always those bigger sizes. I got two 11 and a halves. So talk about the box real quick. You can see that carrot right there. And I love how this Jordan 6 box opens. It's so sick how it just, oof. Even the wrapping, like check out the wrapping. These go crazy. The vibe that I get with these is amazing. Jordan did it again. I don't know why some people were sleeping on these. I kind of like them better than the Jordan 7s. I think I might like the 6 model better is why. But dang, these are clean. You can see all around the shoe, you got the different leathers, synthetic as well as some rubber on the outsole. Dang, these are fire. My favorite right there on the lace lock, the little lace toggle, the carrot is absolute fire. Now, as we get into a overlay of the shoe, you can see that there are different materials around the shoe. You have the leather material, which is obvious. I also first noticed the synthetic leather as well as the textile materials on the shoe. It makes the shoe really nice and I did like what they did with the different materials. You can see the foam midsole as you go towards that air unit on the back and as well as the multicolored rubber sole. I love that outsole. I think that is amazing. You see the natural gray base in there with the white overlays and then a little bit of black accents around the shoe. Inside on the tongue right there, you can see the crazy design that's also on the wrap of the shoe then as you go towards the tongue towards the front view of it you can see that lace toggle that does give the carrot vibes just a sick clean colorway on the hairs surprised that they are kind of slept on but resale is going pretty good right now now as we get into resale predictions with the Jordan 6 hairs you guys got to keep in mind that June has some crazy releases to end the month also, July is going to have a lot of releases. Regarding that they don't get delayed anymore, we should have two crazy months ahead of us. And so my resale predictions with these are going to be pretty straightforward. Right now, if you got them in hand, sell them. They are going for a pretty good price right now. I actually sold both my pairs for a very good profit. Both of these I'm going to take to the post office and ship right after this video, actually. And then I also have another pair coming in from the Nike sneakers app that I'm actually going to do something else with. But for now, I would sell your pairs, get that money, make the quick profit from it and get the money back. Definitely would keep a pair. I might have to keep one that I get in, but for these two pairs, I'm gonna send right out, get the money back, get the profit, so I can put that into other releases. Now, with one of my pairs that I'm getting from the Nike sneakers app, I'm actually going to hold them. And the reason why I'm gonna hold them is because next year, around, I think it's July, 2021, we're supposed to have the Space Jam 2 movie come out. And so your boy is gonna take a risk. I mean, not too big of a risk, but I'm just gonna tuck it away in my closet for about a year and we're gonna see what happens. They should go up in value anyways, but I'm hoping for a huge spike once the movie comes out. So my advice, sell them now. If you want to, tuck a pair or two in your closet and watch the money go up as that film comes out. I guarantee the Jordan 6 Air is gonna be worth it. That's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for sticking around. Let me know what you guys want to see in the future. Comment down below if you like the Jordan 6 hairs. 
check out my other videos as well. Giveaway coming soon. It's looking around 200 subscribers. I'm going to do a giveaway. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you guys next time.